So today I'm going to be doing my foundation routine where I show you how I highlight and contour my face, my canvas, if you will. And I'll also be doing an eyeshadow tutorial video right after this on how I got this look. And if you want to see that, please stay tuned. Of course, first comes my, my foundation, which I use the MAC Pro Longwear Foundation in NW18. And I just blend in some moisturizer with it using just the back of a brush. The moisturizer I was using is Studio 35 Beauty, which I just picked up at my local CVS. Taking my beauty blender, I start in dabbing motions and stipple on the color. I like this because it allows me to slowly build up my color instead of just wiping it and it doesn't leave the same like brush strokes that you get from something else. Now I'm taking more of the product just straight onto the Beauty Blender, I'm slowly blending it down onto my neck. Take note, I'm not going too far down my neck just because I'm not wanting to put makeup all over my chest. Now taking my concealer right onto the Beauty Blender, doesn't matter where you put it, I am highlighting, well first off, the color is NC20, and it's just the Pro Longwear Concealer. I dotted it around my face where I wanted to focus on the highlights, such as my under eyes, my upper lip, the high point of my chin, and the high point of my nose, and my forehead. This concealer is like a full coverage, so it can get a little thick. So I would definitely recommend putting a powder over this just to keep it from creasing. Now taking <laughs> the Bamboo Wear Physician's Formula Bronzer with my 109 brush, just another MAC brush. I'm blending that into the hollows of my cheeks in the C motion to my chin, or not my chin, my jawline, and working it onto the temples of, onto my temples. I'm taking Melba by MAC, which is my favorite blush, with my 188 angled blush brush. I am just gently tossing that over the top of the bronzer, working it back to my hairline. This is Soft and Gentle, which is a mineralized skin finish, and I'm just taking it with my 159 powder brush 
and putting it all over the tops of my, just as like a highlight, it adds a slight shimmer to the face and it's really pretty and I definitely recommend this for anybody. Now, just to finish off the look, I'm taking my MAC pressed powder. It's just in the same color as my foundation. And I am just packing that in over the high points of my face just to make sure that concealer does not move. Last but not least, I'm just putting on a little bit of my favorite lip balm called None of Your Beeswax. I hope you liked my foundation routine video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And if you have any ideas, leave them down below, please. I always love to hear recommendations from you guys. And if you're interested in how I did my eyes right here, then check out my um, eyeshadow tutorial for just like a neutral, um, a neutral eye. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.